Hi. Good morning. What's up, everyone? We are out garage sale hunting. Um, I have a little update on Sprinkles. He has made it to Austin safe. Um, he is all moved into his new place, and he is working at Voodoo Donuts. So if you're ever at the Voodoo Donuts in Austin, go say hi to Sprinkles. I want some donuts. He's there. Maybe he'll give you a donut for free. No, he probably won't. Um, <laughs> we went garage sale hunting last week, didn't put up a video. Uh, I will show a clip um, later in this video from a find last week and some of the other finds. There just wasn't enough uh, stuff from last week to really make its own video, so it's going to get combined with this one. But um, we're going to go by Steve's garage sale he's having today. He's going to have games there, and uh, hopefully we can find some stuff besides at Yay. Steve's. So, to the sales! At the sale right behind us, uh, two video game related finds. Uh, Jeremy, what did you get? Uh, I got a new rag. <laughs> what kind of rag? Uh, you know what kind of rag. <laughs> it is Mario to climb a divide. And it was, uh, what, a dollar? Dollar. Buck. Uh, they had this at 15. She went down to 10, uh, regrettably. She was, she was like, yeah, I guess. Uh, Lego Batman 3 on the PS4. It is new. Sealed. Sealed. Um, apparently they did have, like, an N64 and some other stuff, but they weren't looking to sell. Yeah. I guess they just redid their kid's room, and it has uh, a big entertainment center with all the systems and stuff in there. But We're, we're in a hoity-toity neighborhood. This is a very hoity-toity, um, high-class neighborhood, yeah. so they looked at us pretty strange when, when we walked out. <laughs> We've derived... I, have, I think that's Steve. Is that you? I'm Jamaican Steve. Jamaican Steve today? Okay, I like your hat. Raccoon Thank Police you. Department. Uh, Steve's got... This tasty bin over here, some stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I can go back behind that secret door over there. It's the vault. That's where the <laughs> all the goodies are. Bell Bib Ooh, Jeremy's picking out some, oh, yeah. some solid. Well, Didn't they just put out a new one? They you did. Said? It's a great album. Man. What else did you find? Mortal Kombat. Kombat Corn. I know those guys. Uh, Chili we got peppers. Beck Odelay. Some nice finds. Some Weezer. Weezer. I've made it back into a shed land where there's. All the goodies hiding back here in bins. There's a bunch of Nintendos. They need some, need some love. This one's a little empty inside. Now I just need Rasta Steve to come back here. He's out there helping other people. There he is. He's right there. <laughs> this is what I am grabbing from Steve. We got Majora's Mask on 64, Robocop, uh, Mario Land over there, Mario Party 10, Super Smash Bros. Super Mario 3D Land, Donkey Kong 64, and Spawn on the Super Nintendo. That right there was a hundred bucks. And then in a first for me, I'm actually doing a trade at a garage sale. I'm trading these two GameCubes that I brought them, um, both with one controller and the hookup. And then that Lego Batman I just got uh, for ten bucks at a garage sale and a copy of uh, Halo 5. I'm trading that for a Super Nintendo and a, a Nintendo 64 with a jumper pack in it, so... Steve? Thanks for the money. This sign leads to a sale back down in between these houses in a really dark garage. We've been to this sale... Multiple times. Yeah, every, basically every time they have it, we go to it. I bought a Game Boy here one time. Um, I, I got a few other games last time. I think a PS4, some PS4 games. Um, she has a Super Nintendo. She lets me look at it every time you know we come by. It is like dirty, oh, very very yellow. Has a little chip on it. The power port's broken. Um, she doesn't really ever want to sell it, and the price on it's like two hundred dollars, <laughs> which is her you know basically telling me no, she doesn't want to sell. But she always lets me seem to buy like at least one game or, or one item out of this box. Today's one game I got from her for the Super is a copy of Mario All Stars, and then I also got. This isn't Final Fantasy X, it's actually, was it Tokiden? Yeah, Tokiden on the Vita. And then a copy of Final Fantasy X, X2 on the PS4. Uh, it was 10 bucks for the three items, so um, the prices, when it's not on that Super, are, are fine. Yeah. They're definitely good, but um, maybe someday she'll come down to like, because I told her like 20 bucks for basically a, a broken, because the power port needs to be repaired on it. I'm like twenty bucks, like the most I could offer, and she's like, "Nope, two hundred. I was like, "All right, we're, ne we're never <laughs> gonna make One a deal." Day. Maybe. Jeremy's dad's here to pick him up. Going over Jeremy's finds. What do you think? It's all garbage. Oh come on, Bell Biv DeVoe's in there. It's all garbage. What What do you think of his new wacky rag? It's <laughs> a nice one, man. <laughs> all right, so we're saying <laughs> his face is just floating in blackness right there. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> uh, 
say bye to you guys. Bye bye. But, uh, I actually have uh, a little yard sale I'm going to put on in a few minutes for some people, so that should be interesting. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> so Game this forward. is the uh, this is the garage sale, yard sale in my front yard to Yay. people. In the rain, <laughs> in the rain we're up? we're actually just underneath the cover, so everything's not getting soaked. But uh, uh, state state who you guys are. My name's Matt. Uh, <laughs> we are Southwest Florida Gamers. Woo! Yep. We come up here once every couple of months to do a massive garage sale run. It was like the third trip in the last six months or yeah. so. Yeah. 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 It's the second time we've done this. I posted pictures last time of of trying to sell some stuff in the yard. It went a little better without the rain, but... It was find the Scott Squatch hidden in, that's in amongst what, the leaves. Exactly. <laughs> in his home lair. In his home lair. <laughs> so with that thumping beat... Yeah, and the uh, yeah. the fire truck in the background. Uh, just a quick, uh, this is some of the stuff they picked up. Some PS1 Ooh. title, got your Spyro in there. Some turning up the music louder, apparently. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Secret of Evermore, some Killer Instinct. Mm. Got some uh, Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games. Three and generations of Nintendo. Eight Eyes, X-Zone, and Hey You Pikachu. Hell yeah. Ending with the child-friendly game Woo! at the end. So. Matt loves kids. Thank you guys all for coming. Thank you for having us. Thank and, you for having us. Yes, and to, to you guys watching Woo. more stuff right now. It's Katie and a kitty cat. Hey, a, kitty. That's Moto. Uh, before we do like the random game giveaway and show you the other pickups from past two weeks, actually, um, there's another clip uh, from last week's garage sale I want to throw into this video. It actually includes uh, these two games right here, a couple Kirby's. So here, enjoy that quick clip. Got a few video games. Anticipation on the NES. <laughs> I'm going to pick up a Kirby, a Squeak Squad, Kirby Superstar Ultra, and a DS, like 10 bucks and $5 each. And Jeremy, what, what did you get? Aliens. An alien figure for how much? Two bucks. Two bucks. Lots of stuff. But only a few video game items. <laughs> So yeah, I uh, picked up uh, both Kirby Superstar Ultra and Kirby Squeak Squad for $5 each. Squeaky Squads uh, at that sale. And uh, that DS that I got there for 10 bucks, it's already gone. I, I don't have it anymore. I sold it. Um, let's go ahead and do the random game giveaway. And giveaway. I'm gonna, are you just going to repeat everything I yep. say in a higher pitched tone? In a higher pitched tone. Great, great. Well, while you're doing that, you can wear this. Let's see. Eh. Perfect. There you go. You talk right into there. Awesome. It's a little, it's a little loose. Not like my normal headset. Ugh. It's uh, squeaky. It is a little squeaky. It's um, it's the laser scope. You could use that to talk to your games, and Ooh. basically you could just you could fire by going, fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, pew, pew, pew. That's a lot, a lot more PC way to shoot at your games. Um, so grab Snaggle Fruits, Mr. Tickle. And for the drum roll, I'm going to make it a little more complicated. I need, I need a Mr. Tickle to hold the magic wand and beat Snaggle Fruits with it, please. So, and, yeah, there we go. And then you see the, you got the winner? Yeah. Okay, okay, are we all ready? We're good. The winner of this week's random game on whatever system they want is... Chronicles PS1. Chronicles PS1, congratulations. Yay. Throw the little bastards. Those aren't good. This is the throw. That's how you throw. Well, he bounced! He, did? he came right back up. He bounced like two feet. Uh, congratulations, thank you for watching Chronicles PS1. Uh, Chronicles PS1. Please send a uh, personal message, preferably to the Facebook fan page. Link to that is about okay. belt section down below, but you can send it to the YouTube channel if you want. Anyways, uh, so let me know your mailing address and what system you want your random game to be on, and I'll get that off in the near future. I do have four past oh, prizes. I am holding it the way I want to hold it, like this. There we go, perfect. Um, <laughs> I have like four past prizes I still have to mail out to you guys. Um, there you go. That's going to happen oh, this week, though. Yeah. Um, but, <laughs> hey, guess what, Katie? What? There is a game giveaway starting right now. <gasps> right now? Yes, yes. Awesome. <laughs> you're like high. It's like you're high or something today. What? Huh? Uh, all you have to do is be subscribed, <laughs> thumbs up this video. And, and we, leave a comment down below. Correct. And the comment can be about whatever. whatever. But since the theme that you're going to see with a lot of the other pickups um, is handheld related, uh, give me a suggestion of one of your favorite handheld games or just one that was you know me really memorable to you. And if you don't like handheld games, say, I hate hand handheld games. They're stupid. Screw them. There you go. Um, for me, a suggestion, I really enjoyed uh, Resident Evil Deadly Silence on the DS. It was a good... 
port makeup, whatever you want to call it, not a remake really, of the original Resident Evil, and it added extra stuff to that. You could actually do a regular mode, or you could do like the enhanced mode with like DS features. It was a really, really good port. Um, Katie doesn't really play handheld games, so... Uh, I like handheld games, so fuck you. There you go. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so, that's that what you said caught me off guard, guard. yes. Uh, anyways, that's your suggestion, but you can comment about whatever. It doesn't matter. Just be subscribed. Thumbs up the video. Leave that comment down below. i got to get this out of my hand. There we go. Um, yeah, that's a spell. I know. Accidentally. Uh, I'm a wizard. <laughs> you have until 11.59 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to enter um, on Friday, and the uh, winner is always announced in the following pickups video. All right. Like we did today, just a few minutes. It was ago. just like this. It'll happen again. <laughs> uh, so we had. I saw that happen. Damn it. So. Um, I was like, oh, he's gonna drop it. Yep, there it went. <laughs> last week, last week, uh, same day we got these uh, at the garage sale. Ran into uh, another woman at a garage sale who basically overheard me asking for game. I'm sorry. I had to hook up with her. No, um, I did hook up with her later on, but it was for video games, <laughs> not sexually. Um, she overheard me ask, game favors. asking me for <laughs> games, yes, and uh, she's like, oh, I got two drawers full at home, uh, like I guess dresser drawers she was meaning, of panties, no, of video games. <laughs> I need to show you. Her husband was there too, and um, she basically was like, <laughs> <laughs> she came, come on, stay on track. She gave me uh, her telephone number, I gave her mine, um, she's like, give me a call like in two hours because they were out garage sale hunting too. Um, when she got back, she kind of let me know what she had. We ended up meeting up a little later on. Unfortunately, those two huge drawer folds ended up being a bin about this big. <laughs> and, um, we met in a parking lot, which was, uh, I wanted to kind of film it if I could, but it was her and her husband literally standing over me while I'm like on the asphalt, the parking lot, pulling out games, like looking at them. Like, tiny bin. Yeah, and they, were, they weren't, yeah, I was expecting to go through a bunch of shit and I'm like, okay, here's... Ten games. Anyways, this is what I got. I think, oh, there's another one. Found it. All right. Uh, handheld theme. This is where it comes into play. Uh, Mario Kart Super Circuit. We have Pokemon, Ruby, uh, Mario, or uh, Super Mario World on the Game Boy Advance, Yoshi's Island, Super Mario 3, uh, Pokemon Emerald, Pokemon Sapphire, Couple loose cart games, uh, Kirby Mass Attack, and a Sims 3. The Sims. Is that including all the ones you dropped? Those are, the, I picked okay. them up, yep. Uh, Sims 3 and Sims 3 Pets on the 3DS still go for like tw 20 and $30 around there. I've never played them. Never played any of those? Eh, you're better off probably playing Sims on PC still. That's yeah. why there are no more Sims games coming to consoles, because no one really, I don't think they ever really did. Because you can't type in Rosebud. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cheat, so <laughs> there's no point. A crimson and black uh, DS. No charger for that. Um, this stack of DS games, which the only one that actually had a case that I got from her was Final Fantasy III. I had spare cases for Final Fantasy Tactics Advance 2, Sonic Rush, and a Mario Kart. All of that. Guess how much that was, Katie? I have no idea. That's a bad guess. That's not a guess $5. at all. Five dollars. No, that would $10. be... Ten uh, dollars. Okay. Fifteen dollars. No, it, it was $20. $40. Forty dollars. Forty dollars. Yes. Um, Picking up shit. Great price. Uh, sh they, they had some other stuff. They had like a 360 they tried to sell me for like 25 bucks. It was an original one. They said that the, the disc tray uh, the, was not really functioning very well. They kind of had to like pull it out. And I was like, I don't want a 360. That's okay. Thank you. Um, but $40, and she said if they come across more games... Oh, because... Shit, I forgot these two that were included in there. Mario All-Stars and a Mario Duck Hunt. This is what I originally was excited for. She said, oh yeah, we got some of those old Nintendo oh, carts. Nintendo stuff. And this is what it. all it was. Um, but included in that for 40 bucks, amazing. But uh, she said if they find more of these, because um, she thought she had more, she'll let me know. It always blows my mind when people are like, you know, they... They don't it's know somewhere in a closet, like, buried in how underwear. big is how big is your house that you don't know where, <laughs> where stuff is, or maybe, maybe they got rid of it ten years ago and they just don't remember. Pawn uh, shop find from earlier in this week. Uh, a another DS, no charger. Oh, is a game in there? Does this? I don't remember. I don't even know where the hell that came from. Free game. <laughs> Sonic and Sega All Stars. That might have been with this stuff actually. Anyways, uh, Sonic and Sega All, All Stars is in there. 
Um, that did not come from the pawn shop though, because I remember there was nothing in here. But uh, DS Lite, no charge, that was five bucks. And I, they brought out a stack of games for me to go through. Um, check. Price, price check, five dollars for Sonic. No, yeah. for the DS. For the, for the DS, five bucks? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, no, yeah, like I said, no charge. Hey, look, it stayed. Good, don't break it. Um, they brought out a stack of games for me to go through that was in the back, and uh, out of that stack, I grabbed for $10 each a Sunshine and a Pokemon XD, both, I think, complete. Yeah, and there we go. Um, and then they had this in there, which <laughs> basically, like, what the fuck oh, is this? A... Yeah, Game Boy Player startup yeah, disc. Yeah. They were like, what is this? And I was like, oh, it's for the Game Boy Player and the thing. They didn't have the player. They, don't, they didn't have a GameCube. They're like, no, oh, fuck it. Here you go. <laughs> so th that was free, nice. which is basically the same price as either of these two games. So for 20 bucks, all three of those. That was really cool. Uh, these were just full price. Well, kind of not full price, but pickups from a game store that I hadn't been to in since they opened, so four years, five years ago, roughly. Um, it's a little far away from here, uh, for where I live. Um, game On, I believe is the name of it. I got Windy Every Which Way, which is a game about a witch. I love Halloween, love Halloween-related games. It's like a $30, $25, $30 uh, Game Boy game, and he had it 20 bucks, and I didn't have it in my collection, so I went ahead and picked that up. And then uh, Hyper Load Runner on the Game Boy, that was 8 so basically, roughly the price that they go for, but they're things that I didn't, you know, have. And they were both really clean, um, so I grabbed them. And then... I grabbed them! So the <laughs> And then finally, uh, this was a week and a half ago now, roughly. Um, I, I just posted recently the photo of these games on Facebook, on uh, the Facebook VGS fan page. Um, these were from a connection... I, I try to explain everything in as much detail as possible, and I know if you don't watch the whole video or get to these points, then you don't know the whole story. I don't know what to say, but uh, the story behind these is, no, uh, they weren't found directly at a garage sale, but they were found through a person that I've gone to their garage sale many times. He frequently has games out. He started selling a lot of his games online. He doesn't really put them out to sale. You haven't talked for a while. Say something. I know. Say something. Um... I like the t the front of this. You game. like the cover? You can get yeah. yeah. Well, it has a pony. No wonder it has a horse on it. Um, here you can hold him and look at him. Uh, basically, he had a big Genesis lot. He had texted me about, and I hadn't seen or talked to him for months. I haven't been to a garage sale that he's had. And he goes, "Are you interested in a Genesis lot? Never mind the price, because it was a link to eBay. It was like five hundred dollars. He had it had a bunch of game system, extra controllers." But he goes, never mind the price, I just put, like, sort of a, a whatever crazy price on it. Um, we ended up meeting up, and... Come on. I was reading this Ori of Rome, too. I'm like, oh, I wonder what the first one looked like. And it's I looked one. over, and it's the <laughs> next one now. <laughs> oh, look, there it is. So I ended up getting these... Cool. One, two, three, like four, it. five, six, seven. Cool. Eight games. I got eight games from them. Um, it was $85, um, but... It's probably about half of what they would go for. That's sort of what we were going on. Um, he said he's like, I know you're you know you're not looking to pay the full price, so you know we'll work out a deal. So these are the ones I picked out. They are all complete. Um, it looks like you're always on a horse. <laughs> Warriors of Rome. Yeah, they're like little eight bit Uno? person horses. And do no. that's not eight bit. How dare you? Sixteen bit. You? How dare you? Um, then Galahad, uh, which I didn't I didn't have those two in my collection. I didn't have Galahad in my collection. And then we have the fairy tale I'm sensing a theme adventure. Here. Yeah, there are a lot of like medieval, uh, some dungeony, dragony kind of ones there. Uh, Fantasy Star Three. Everybody has a sword and shield. Well, yeah, you had to. That guy does too. Yeah, every Star. single one. Oh, guess what? Shining Force. He has a sword and shield. Uh, yeah. Oh no, the, the the skeletons have the shields. He just has the sword. Guess what? Shining in the darkness. And a dagger. Uh, he has a sword as well. No shields in that picture. Oh, wait. Oh, oh. my God. Every single one of them. Oh, sorry. There wasn't... I... Every single one of them. <laughs> There's not supposed to be two copies of Fairy Tale. One uh, was the one I got from him, which was complete. The other one was my copy. I swapped out the manuals. I left my copy on the counter, so my bad. That extra one didn't come in it, but there we go. So that was 85 bucks, and uh, like I said, it was... It was technically uh, linked through garage sales by meeting him at a garage sale and then later on him contacting you. You had to leave your number with everyone. It's mo all fines. I'd say 90% of my fines 
Um, no, so not all of them. 90% of them. Um, <laughs> all of them. 90, 90, 85, <laughs> you know, like 75%. They come from not like walking up to a garage sale and shit sitting on a table. It's talking with people and getting hookups and connections from later on. Oh, so. I think my cousin has an old Nintendo he was trying to get rid yeah. of. Yeah. I, I barely find anything these days sitting out of a Is sale. It? Yeah. And if I do, it's 360 games or a controller or something that that usually... Um, or, I mean, like, some DS stuff, some handheld stuff every once in a while. But in general, it's by asking and talking and, you know, getting hooked up. So, anyway, uh, thank you all for watching. Don't forget to enter the random game giveaway by being subscribed, thumbsing up this video, and leaving that comment down below. And anything else, Katie, you have to say? If you guys haven't read Ready Player One yet, you should. It's really good. Those reminded me of it. Oh, okay. Yes, yeah, so that was a good book. One of the last full books that I, uh, I you read myself. Really read. I read all the time. The movie should be coming out in the future at some point. I hope so. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Love you. Love you. Peace. Peace.